When developing new technologies, it's important to meet customer expectations, and a key expectation is range. So our FCHV Advanced has range over 300 miles, and today we're going to be demonstrating that range to the Department of Energy with support from the National Renewable Energy Laboratory and Savannah River National Laboratory. The main output from this will be the driving range on a full tank of fuel from all the way full to empty. So we'll actually be driving probably about three quarters or a little bit more than that, uh, actual driving, and then we'll use the remaining fuel to calculate how far the vehicle would have gone if it had driven using all the fuel. So that's the main thing is the driving range of the vehicle and basically showing that uh, using today's technology um, you can achieve uh, above 300 miles of real world driving. So this morning we're going to hit rush hour traffic <laughs> and then we're going to do a lot of city driving, kind of a lot of stop and go and then we'll do some kind of middle speed driving where you're going maybe 35 to 55 miles an hour and then freeway driving. So we're going to hit all the major drive cycles. This is the FCHV Advanced, which stands for Fuel Cell Hybrid Vehicle Advanced. So a fuel cell takes oxygen from the air and hydrogen, which we store in four hydrogen tanks, and it, um, through electrochemical reaction, it reaction produces um, electricity, and then the byproduct's water, so water is what comes out the tailpipe. And then um, we drive an electric motor with that uh, electricity, so um, it's a pure electric vehicle, it just uses hydrogen as its source for power. We store our hydrogen in uh, four hydrogen tanks, so we have approximately six kilograms of hydrogen on board. And a kilogram of hydrogen has the same energy content as a gallon of gasoline, so it's a very nice one-to-one uh, -one comparison. So if I say that we're getting you know, 60 to 70 miles per kilogram, it's equivalent to 60 to 70 miles per gallon. The car's been um, performing really well. We've been getting um, 60 plus miles per kilogram fuel economy, so that's really good, especially for a SUV sized vehicle and we've been driving just normal traffic speeds so keeping up with traffic flow um, on the city streets and then on the freeway so you know from Toyota's perspective you know this vehicle is a reality it's getting close you know 2015 is coming and we believe we can have a car that we can sell at that time so we're starting to hit a lot of traffic now <laughs> it's rush hour so this is going to be a lot of city stop and go driving from now until the end, so it's going to be a long drive. So we made it, 10 and a half hours of driving, 14 hours since we left here. It's been a, been a long day, but uh, uh, very productive, I think. You know, we feel this is a, a really good step and event to demonstrate the advances that we've had in fuel cell technology, such as range. And it demonstrates the viability of fuel cell technology for the future. So we're really happy, and we're really happy with the results.